now i own this area it's for me <laughs> hey my loves welcome back to my channel i am very excited you guys have no idea i am so excited to have you here today and if you haven't subscribed i would ask you to do so because that's what keeps on pushing me to do this beautiful kind of videos and also think and get out of the box today i am doing something beautiful wonderful i am showing you how bad i mean how bad my closet is or was i want to show you how bad it was how i corrected it and how i turned my room into a walk-in closet isn't that not a nice thing i feel for me this is something that i always wanted this is something that i kept on waiting list for a long time i don't know why i never did this honestly i have no explanation for this first of all i want to show you how bad my closet was that's the clip because at the beginning i thought if i have those racks for hanging my clothes it would be so easy for me to figure out how this i can have this for that but let me tell you it never worked like i thought because one problem was that first of all when it was during winter or autumn uh, the jackets are very heavy so the racks are not able to hold it properly and in the end i ended up like balancing out with weight and i know it just looked kind of messy not messy and i would today for example i would say let me fix this today and then the next day i come back i'm like oh i'm looking for a trouser i'm looking for this i'm looking for that then boom messy room once again i decided to like i need to remove my clothes for summer because they they're very light clothes very light outfits and so you have like a spaghetti top you have a bra you have this you have that you have this you have that so i removed everything and then i also chose things that i don't need outfits that i don't need anymore so i decluttered every single outfit that i didn't need i put it aside and something that I know I will put on next year so I set it aside as well and I will show you as the video goes on At this point i put everything aside i mean i remove all the outfits and put them aside so that it becomes very very easy for me to see what i need what i don't need what i'm taking away completely what i will put aside i mean just generally unpacking every single item
so after i sorted my clothes out i removed everything that belongs to summer everything that belongs to that warm weather i immediately started uh, positioning them into different parts set them aside then now i started putting them in the boxes putting them on the uh, how do you call them the suitcases and then i put them all aside and then immediately i started now taking my jackets from the storage area i picked all my jackets i picked all the warm clothes that i need for this season because you know autumn winter it's uh, spring as well at the beginning of spring it's going to be cold so i brought all of that in and then i started sorting them out and i put them at the racks remember at this stage yet i have not gone to ikea i have not gone to look for an alternative way of hanging my clothes I am now separating the clothes that I normally wear in the house I mean just the outfits for lounging and as you can see I am putting all my jackets all my winter coats on the same place all my trousers on the same place because at this point I am still using the clothes rack ha never mind this side is always messy talk about messiness oh my god that corner that corner oh this one gives me headache every other time but let's wait there will be a solution for it So now I am working on my makeup area because this makeup table has lots of hidden things in there. There's some makeup you buy, you remove the packaging last minute, then you leave the packaging inside there. There's some makeup brushes I don't need anymore. There's just a lot, a lot of decluttering to be done. These are the wig stands and sometimes I use them, but you know, there's no space at this moment. So it's not even something that I'm thinking about. I'm just decluttering this area completely so that I'm able to dust off completely.
so now i am working on my shoe area and the place where i put my handbags that i wear or carry from time to time i'm just praying with water dust off the whatever that's there clean the shoes as well just dusting them off because they're not so dirty i always clean them every other time because <laughs> you would think since we live here they, there's not dust but there's dust there's a lot of dust every day At this point i'm also trying to see the type of shoes that i don't need anymore <laughs> quite a lot but you know some of them i just need to see them there because i would wear them when i'm taking pictures and you know we don't know what's happening or what's about to happen for the coming days so i'm just leaving the shoes that i think i might need and then i will now bring my boots because they were not there so i will just bring my boots because i need them for this season until march So this is almost done and after this I'm just thinking tomorrow I will just wake up in the morning and head on to Ikea and get the necessary stuff just to window shop in case I don't find anything that I like I will also head to JYSK Yes, can see what to do. Now on this same day that I woke up and I decided let me now go to Ikea and I have set up my mind now. I don't want anything from Misk. I don't want anything from any other store because I have already done the window shopping part and I didn't vlog that part. So now I went to Ikea. I had already made up my mind. I want this. I don't want this on my list. And then that so, uh, heading to Ikea and um, um, I've already selected the parts that I want in twos and there's some parts of the drawers that I don't need but I will explain that later so here we are Ikea Ikea baby hey guys so today we are at Ikea and we are trying to get um, things for the wardrobe sorry for the walk-in closet I will have to assemble it in the coming days it's not going to be easy but I think I will be very pleased with the results so this is where they have alternatives of uh, closets you can choose from and customize for yourself and at this point i had already come before and i knew what i had selected in my head i will now head on to measure select the parts that i don't need at this point i have also asked for extra paperwork from ikea for the extra wardrobe patterns or extra accessories that i need no no i don't want those then these you have four of them yes, instead of yes. two yes yes four of these then you have these two mm -hmm. one and another one there yes 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 then you have uh, two of those things to slide here yes 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 those ones are two of them and then you have one blasting Yes, and yeah, instead of that, then I have the glass thing there. I think that's perfect. Two of those. Okay. My trolley that's the small trolley is mine Thank you. 
I was very very tired the next day so I was like you know what I have done enough shopping I've, you know how big Ikea usually is so I went up I went down I picked this I picked that I everything was so heavy we had to go back there like two times so I decided just that day I had to sleep relax wake up with full mood on and bam I started working on my closet When it's time to fix this Ikea, Ikea anything, anything that you need to assemble, you have to be extremely careful to read the manual. Otherwise, one wrong thing, one wrong procedure, then you'll have to put the whole thing down. And do you know how disappointing that is? The effort, the time, the energy you put on this. Always be careful when you're doing this. So uh, it's uh, late at night but um, I want to finish because I've already uh, set up those uh, two of them the other one is behind it and I'm also not feeling so well so that's why I look a little bit moody or I don't know I would have finished this earlier but I took a break so I'm now trying to like uh, set up uh, this yeah um, they're like shelves for there and then um and then i did this so i already have in mind how i'm supposed to separate this and this so this is the first one the first one and the, the first one and the second one so because uh it's like um you customize it yourself you choose the things you want to put the shelves you don't want to put so you completely customize everything for yourself so i already chose in the store what i need and what i don't need and i will just go right away to fixing the top shelves and the rest and then we'll wait for what's about to happen
so now i am done fixing my closet everything is in order i have placed it in the room i have already cleaned the room everything is in order i've put everything still on the racks and now i know where to put the jackets where to put this where to put that honestly it was very smooth very easy to do this and i am now currently enjoying enjoying this kind of enjoyment i'm entering into my room it feels so lively it feels so good i feel like now i own this area it's for me <laughs> so yeah now i am so happy i am so excited to be here i love everything here i don't want to change anything unless we move out to a bigger place and if we move out to a bigger place of course i will add on some things remove some things but that's to discuss later as for now let me enjoy what i have i will now head on to show you what i will have and where i have placed every other item guys so i am now done with everything i think so i assume so this is uh, the transformation part of everything so um as you can see i decided to put this rack here with things that we are constantly wearing at the moment and these are my business boxes and then from here now you have my shoes just as usual nothing much has changed here just the same 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 and then those were just there as well so nothing has changed on that side as well um so this is the different part like everything here has totally transformed and i'm so in love with this because i'm even deciding to put a few stuff there because i will add them later because um they're in a different room and it will just take time before i organize things that i don't use at the moment they're still in the storage area and then this is now the place where um i have like the clothes that i wear the tops everything in there and up here is where i put uh, the sunglasses that i might use in this season but i'm not sure because it's cold now and then a few other stuff like belts and just the accessories and up here i still have like my dresses that i use that are functional only for functions but you know at the moment that's not happening so anyway they'll just stay there and then i still have my jackets that are not long like the blazers and then here now i have my winter jackets that i will use at the moment I, the only thing is that i wish i have like uh, white hangers but anyway this will do at the moment i will in case i change anything in future i will of course update you and then this is the most amazing thing that i have owned to be honest because now i can fit in my pants in there and then down there because now it's cold i really need this i really 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 need that and then these are the clothes that i either want to wear now or anything those are like my hearts my scarves and i removed my makeup table and i prefer using this because i feel it really looks good together with that it just looks like a complete thing it's also from ikea and it's also holding a few clothes inside there and i removed my makeup table because to be honest how many times do i use it not long so i put my makeup there and uh, of course my perfumes i don't have a lot of perfumes i'm not a perfume junkie and a few of my of uh, this uh accessories they're also there my chains my whatever <laughs> as you can see and then this is also just the way it was maybe a little bit i just changed the carpets from one room to the other but anyways it's fine and this is a poof and inside it's also for storage so i have everything that i need and i know every other time when i put them in the wardrobe they just get dirty or i just misplace them so i feel they are safe safe very very safe there yes so that was it so my loves if you've subscribed to my channel thank you so much many thanks to you we are on the road to like more subscribers i i wish to have a lot of subscribers i wish to have all of you here and it has been really a really really exciting journey i cannot complain i am seeing the growth i will keep on saying this i am still seeing the growth please don't forget to share this video with your friends whether on whatsapp instagram twitter tumblr Anywhere you feel comfortable to do this, I will be very, very happy because remember, this gets me excited to like upload a video for you, go through all this hustle and bustle of doing all these things just to be with you and just to share these beautiful moments with you. 
thank you so much and i'm looking forward to see you on the next video you can also suggest for me what other kind of video you would like me to shoot and i will be glad to do that thank you so much Mwah.